can I see a show of hands for everybody who's been bullied or been a victim of a mean girl? Almost, I'd say three quarters of the people here. That is so not okay. So not okay. We've got to make some changes. We've got to make a difference, guys. Really want Birch Jaw to be a place where there are no mean girl behaviors and there isn't any bullying. Because I, I know that that stuff goes on at home and I can't control that. I want to try and control it here so that you come here and you get a break from that and you can feel good and feel how nice it is when everybody's kind and everybody feels welcome and everybody feels safe. At Birch Trail, we have some rules in place that help with the mean girl behaviors. We teach you how to use when you I feel statements. We can become upstanders instead of bystanders. Instead of standing by and letting that happen. If we stand up and you find your voice and you use it, when we do our cabin meetings, that's a good way to talk about the things that might be a little bit annoying or might be bothersome to us so we can get rid of the mean girl behaviors. I want you to be thinking about being an upstander and ending the mean girl behavior because I really believe, girls, we can make a difference. This group right here can start changing things in the world. If you practice being an upstander and getting rid of the mean girl behaviors and bullying right here at Birch Trail for the next three weeks, you can all go home to London, to China, you know, to Germany, to California, to New York, to Boston, to Cleveland, to all these different cities, and you can do it at home, and we can start a wave, and we can really start making a difference.